there could the girl be, being like, whoa, this guy's creeping me out. There could be creepy girls, though, right? Yeah, not really. Somebody new? I don't do that. You're going to lie to thousands of fans. <laughs> a real creep can't read that. That's the real issue. A true Yeah, creep. but what if the creep is really attractive? No. Girls can smell creep. No. no or she doesn't eat out of a box at all, this woman. That yeah. can go oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Or uh Come or, on. Or even uh I was just listening <laughs> Come to on. Dwayne the Welcome back, Cobb Thunder. I'm your host on the mic. Be sure to give this thing a thumbs up. Subscribe. New videos twice a week. We got the one and only. Daniel Stormcloud Iolos. <laughs> Iolos. Yeah. That's good. That's I like good. What, am I Greek now? Uh, that does something. You can name a same. noodle company after that. Yeah, you could we could be Iolos. <laughs> That's not a bad idea. <laughs> All right. This topic Iolos. We're not talking about food this time. <laughs> okay. Aliotos? Yeah, what about it? What about it? Aliotos is great. That's a staple in uh San Francisco Fisherman's work. No, no. Well, I don't know if it's a staple. I feel like No, it's it is the staple of Fisherman's oh, work. Oh, which one's tucked away? Um. Well, I mean, there's a bunch. No, no, no. One's tucked in the dock. That's well, Aliotos. Oh, that, that, so I feel like what I was going to say is like er, er, a while ago. Now everyone knows, but I feel like it wasn't known. So Aliotos, It was like the secret spot. Yeah, Aliotos. Well, there's a, obviously a huge sign where you can like see if you're on a ferry. <laughs> well, then that's not the one I'm talking that's about. That's not tucked it? in. No, right. it, it's tucked in a street. It's it's so like... The one I'm talking about, you go like down the dock and through an alley kind of, and then it's there. Oh, I don't know what you're you do. About. You do, you do. Ladies and gentlemen, the big arm. <laughs> Kyle Kevlar. I always. That's part. That's, uh, I always. I get right to that. Yeah. And the legend Jim McD, 3SP.co, 50% facts. <coughs> we got a mix here, which is good. I think we got like a like a newlywed going on. Newlywed? We got um, as single as it gets <laughs> going on. Mm -hmm. We got married for quite a while going on. Uh, yeah, it's been a minute, yeah. And this topic is covered a lot, but I feel like it's covered in a douchebag manner. And since we're all gentlemen here, I feel like we could cover it in another manner. Um, right. Talking to anyone in the gym is an awkward stage and an awkward thing, mm -hmm. depending on the type of gym you go to. Obviously, we try to set up our gym so it is approachable, it's a community, and everyone at least says a what's up. But if you go to a commercial gym, I'm not even giving the bros a head nod. Like, I'm head down, headphones on. But here, I'm saying what's up to everybody. Or, or any other gym of this stuff. Barber Brigade, when I go visit mm -hmm. it, I don't know anybody, but I'm just throwing up peace signs as I'm walking through, you know? Yeah. Like, you just say what's up. You don't say what's up to me. For a good reason. Oh. But to talk to the opposite sex is one thing mm. very difficult, kind of anywhere, you know, whether you have confidence or not. Like, I think I'm a very confident dude. And the one skill I have in the world is talking. That's the only thing I'm uh, semi OK at. I don't babble. I, I ramble, but I don't babble. Mm -hmm. But at like a grocery store, everyone like the typical joke, like, yeah, find chicks at the grocery store or whatever. Or in a gym. Whole Foods. Well, that's what they say. Produce aisle. That's what a healthy my girl. wife is. Yeah, I've already met her. Whole Foods and Trader Joe's. <laughs> She's got a. You've basket already stared full at her. <laughs> you haven't met her. She has a basket full of lettuce. That's it. Oh, that's oh you like has. salads? <laughs> Just Lululemon head to toe. That's yeah. All. yeah, that's and my some wife. Lean cuisines. No, 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 no. no <laughs> the no. lean pocket. Nothing Spinach. boxed. My There's mom nothing. tried to force me on those. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Mikey gets hot pockets. Danny gets lean pockets. Yeah, yeah. She tried to force me on those growing up. No, no, no. Or she doesn't eat out of a box at all. This woman. That yeah. could go oh, elsewhere. Hey. <laughs> Whoa. Or uh, come or, on. Or even. Uh, I was just listening <laughs> to on. Dwayne the You're Rock Johnson's disgusting. radio. Okay. And, oh, you uh, were sweet. He, well, he updates it. <laughs> he updates it because he has a new song out with Tech Nine. I did oh. see that. Interesting. And then the oh, next song bad. that comes yeah. on is Tech Nine, who I am a fan of. Shout out to KC. But he has a whole song called The Box. Oh, I've heard it. But he's rapping like that. Yeah. About the box. Yeah. There's nothing better or wetter in that box. There's the chorus. Yeah, that's a bit much. No, that's a lot. That's yeah. A lot. It's not even like cool. Well, like, no, it's not like, even like I'm like not going to play that in my in the car with my boys. Well, like, yo, <laughs> fucking box. Dude, this shit's wet. Like, well, what, about when, what about that's when what he the, said? The Cardi B came out, the WAP. Or yeah, whatever. but that's, yeah, that's just. That's true. It's on the nose. Yeah, it's yeah terrible. it is. All right. Uh, or back to my topic of the day. Even trying to make friends as you get older, like, like you go to school or whatever, you're trying to meet a bro or even a workout partner, a training partner. How do you approach, Dan, you're a charismatic guy. I guess you talk to a lot of people. How do you approach that? Like, do you go in with the mindset like, yeah, man, I'm going to find someone benching. I'm going to see if he wants to work out with me or I'm going to find my wife at the gym. I'm going to do some cable kickbacks with her. Or, 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 or does it have to naturally happen? I'm I'm not an, I don't approach people. Okay, you're I just going to lie to the no, thousands no, of fans? No, 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 dude. 
when I was in college, we can't go anywhere without you talking to someone. That's true. No, no, but I'm talking about like if I'm trying to approach somebody new, I don't do that. You're gonna lie to thousands mm-hmm. of fans, dude. I promise you. Dan, when I was I've in known college, you for a long time, and you talk to every single person everywhere we go. Yeah, that's because they know me. Like they, they've, <laughs> okay. introduced, they've introduced themselves to me. But every I single person, Come I on, don't know. I don't go out of my way to introduce myself to people. I really don't. Like when I was in college, I was ex- like, okay, for example, if I had a class by myself in college, mm-hmm. I was extremely introverted, and I would sit in the back of the class, and unless someone spoke to me. I literally would sit back there and not say a fucking word to anybody. I don't know what it is, but like if I find myself in an environment, if I think it's environment related. If there's no one around me that I don't that I don't know, like if you're with me, yeah, I I might have a little bit more like Oh, I give you confidence. Uh, maybe No, yeah. just say it. Look at that Mike, camera. Mike gives me confidence. That's what I try to do in this world. But if I'm by myself, I typically I don't really approach people. Okay, people think so I'm scary. does anyone want to tell the truth when we're talking? Yeah. So, <laughs> besides that point, let's get to the the meat and potatoes of the argument. Okay. How it's to about find a wife tr- in the a, gym? It's about attraction, right? Okay. That's what this whole conversation is about. Okay. Right. It could be. I'm laying down a rule, and I'm gonna give credit to one of our actual members here. I'm okay. not gonna say his name. I'm gonna call him C Money. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Because I don't want to say his full name. <laughs> He's been on the podcast. You just no, 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 no. Oh, a different no, C money. No, different C money. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I don't mm. even yeah, know go. what C money you're talking about. All right, continue. I have a different C money. Yeah. But he, very quiet individual, very nice guy, strong guy. And he kind of came out of his show a little bit when he was uh, hanging out with us. And he was like, you know, it should be a rule. Like, chicks should talk to the dudes and shouldn't be the other way around. What's that called? Sadie Hawkins. Yeah, yeah. He what, was what like, "What if we just lived in a Sadie Hawkins world?" And, and then, and then, and then, uh, somebody else was like, "Oh no, but I want guys to approach me at the gym." And then he goes, "Yeah, if you find them attractive, but most of the time they don't. So then it's a creepy thing, you know what I mean? Then it's like, then it's just all, then it's just messed up. But True. then there's a lot more leeway the other way around. If girls are, yeah, if the girl approaches the guy, the guy's, like, oh, you know what? I'm sorry, I'm just not interested. Versus yeah, there the could girl be, being like, "Whoa, this guy's creeping me out." There could be creepy girls though, right? Yeah, not really. No. Never a creepy girl. No, there's. I'm sure there's been one in the history of human beings. Yes, you don't oh, think oh, there has. Yeah, for sure. But let's talk about comparisons. No, but what I'm saying, if we turn the universe upside down and we lived in a Sadie Hawkins world for the last two thousand years, yeah, yeah, I bet you we would know of more creepy women. Y- yeah, probably. That's not. That's not an issue though. But no, like, I'm saying they're there. Now. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm saying I'm they're sure there. They but yes. but because of the societal norm that the dude hits on the chick, dudes show their creepy harder. No, uh, I don't think so. No, no. You just think no, dudes are no. creepier. Uh, yeah, because I they have. Think, if yeah, they have, if they have a bad are. intent, it's like more likely. It's it's a, more of an extreme version of that intent. You know what I mean? I Versus think it's a, a chick doing a chick. What's a chick gonna? I mean, if she's obviously insane and does something, then it's like okay, that chick's insane. But guys are just come on. They're more violent. More this and that. They are like more that. violent. Yeah, like they're just in nature. You know, it's the power imbalance that you're talking about. Because guys typically are bigger, stronger. Yeah, and a little bit more prone. Well, maybe a lot more prone well, to violence. No, for more sure. More testosterone. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just statistically speaking. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. When I was in high school, I had a girl who was uh, totally hung up on me, and I just could barely stand to be around her. And she was uh, not only was she not attractive to me, she was just not attractive. She was creepy, and she was creepy about it. And she was like constantly engineering things when we were where we yeah, would be. Weird. <laughs> together or whatever yeah. and like she she's actually, the whole school she actually you're had married an, they could be she, very conniving <laughs> she actually had I'm an ex-boyfriend try to beat me up at a party see that's creepy no yeah. it is because i was like violent though yeah I, but how often i'm just saying yeah, like I, versus I, like that's like a one in like no. for men it's like 90 percent no i feel like a woman. men men are more openly creepy women are very like silently like i think they're just as creepy. they're more conniving i think they're sure, just whatever just as creepy just as creepy but just more in a Silent way, they're not what's as the, like. Open. What's the fucking bitch's song? Uh, I st- stuck my keys into the side of his. Four it's just talking about Carrie Underwood. <laughs> <laughs> That's an icon. <laughs> that you bitch, show your damn respect. She, to got, Carrie she Underwood, got broken dude. up with once and keys the shit out of your truck. No, she made a banger. That's what she did. Yeah, and then she, she went home rich with it. Yeah. yeah, exactly. She didn't actually do any of that shit. But no, they're crazy. There's a difference. Okay, whatever term you want to use. <laughs> no, that's different. No, because if creepy we're in the Sadie, crazy. If uh, we're, I would say that the, the creepy and crazy are kind of the same thing. If you're in the no. Sadie Hawkins world, they'd just be expressed more often publicly because then they would be hitting on us all the time. Well, there'd yeah, probably yeah, be a lot yeah. less yeah. like rape in the world. If, well, yeah, if, probably. Yeah, a whole lot less probably. What yeah. about a lady uh, 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 proposing to a dude? I jokingly have said uh, this for a long time. Sucks. I want a, yeah, no. I want a girl to shave her head and. Oh. Propose no. to me, and that's when I'll get married. You, yeah, that's not any happen. girl. 
But like the don't girl. approach like Sinead O'Connor. Don't, yeah, don't ever say that. Like don't G. approach G. women in the gym. Like G.I. Jane. You don't get to. Like G.I. G. Oh, Jane. Demi Moore. You don't like G.I. Jane. She's about a crazy woman. Act. Who? Who? Demi Moore. Yeah, love oh, that. Yeah. She's I would crazy. love to marry Demi. What? You like a little crazy keeps life interesting. What do you want, a vanilla bean? <laughs> True. Crazy um, can be attractive sometimes. <laughs> no, crazy is attractive. Why is Dan so red? Hot. Crazy I think is one of the most profound, one of the most profound <laughs> things that Joe Rogan ever said was avoid crazy women. Yeah, they all say that, but but well, they don't at, do that after <laughs> after Phil Hartman's wife killed him. Mm. Well, that's yeah, that's a little next level crazy. All right, how, do you we, won't, how do you know if someone's gonna kill you? How oh, do you actually know? Yeah, you can't. Not yeah. if they're a good sociopath. Yeah. Yeah, or a psychopath. They're like, oh, yeah, I hated him for 10 years. You're like, what? Yeah. <laughs> what? But, yeah. but So do we just not approach in the gym, or do we wait in the style of the gym? What's the move? I, I don't think approach. you go. I don't after. approach in the gym. Oh. Yeah, I don't. I have never, never? have. Uh-huh. You got to be sneaky. You got to be smart. You just got to be play yeah, cool? Yeah. Drop a weight on the ground. Oh, my bad. Was I, were you yeah, 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 yeah. That's how I was. That's how I was just rolling school. 45s across yeah. the gym I was chasing them. Clanking. Whoopsies. I know it's not a little bit different, but in school, yeah, I was that guy like, oh, yeah, like maybe we could like work out, or no, maybe we could like like uh, help each other on homework or whatever, and then that would be my like in. So what do you do now? Hey, could you help me um with taxes and laundry? Yeah. I thought you didn't approach. <laughs> I thought you'd never approach. No, people he though. lied. He yeah. lied for I, the whole I, first I part of this. But video. like, I'm what I'm saying is that would be my kind of like like way of trying to approach people. Like, yeah. hey, let's if we need help on a uh, let's study anatomy. Like that. Yeah, I, yeah, whatever. No, no, not whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Biology. <laughs> birds in the, I'm in Birds and the Bees 101. Yeah. You want to study? The sciences. Whatever I'll, you're I'll play foosball. Yeah. Well, <laughs> question. Is it better to approach someone when they're entering a space that you're going to be in or when they're leaving, exiting? Leaving. Leaving for sure. Leaving. Yeah. You feel the vibe. You maybe get some eyes. Yeah. When they're leaving. It, also, they have, an act, they have an out. If they don't want to talk to you, they... Sorry, I until go. you fall into the car, that's why you and hop don't. In the front seat. Yeah, that's why you don't give them an out. You corner them. <laughs> yeah, the, so you. There's one way you, in and out of the you bathroom. You sit right you on the driver's the... side. <laughs> There's one way. In the back. So. Uh, <laughs> oh, I see you left your oh, keys yeah, out. Oh yeah, are these yours? <laughs> <laughs> Creeps. No, dude. Not if it works. <laughs> that's the that's the answer though. You're not a creep if she's into you. That's true. That's uh, what, that was my main point in the beginning. That was my whole point. Yeah, but the issue is that's that... That's what a, C-Money was saying. A real creep can't read that. That's the real issue. A true yeah, creep... Yeah, but what if the creep is really attractive? No. Girls can smell creep. No, I know, but they're still like, uh, I think I'll look past it for this one. <laughs> <laughs> he must be hung. Have you seen his abs? Yeah. Do you think men can smell psychos? No. no. Crazy? We're stupid. Men? No, yeah, no, we're no. stupid. This, that's the way men work, right? We're either really, <laughs> really stupid or we're the smartest people on earth. Yeah. It, that's it. Yeah. Women, it's more like they're kind of just smart, like generally. <laughs> No. Men are like, we can't even grab our own ass with both hands and then, or. Wait, what? Huh? You never heard that term? <laughs> no. Yeah. Yeah, can't find your ass with both hands. Yeah. Oh, like a, it's like a duh thing. It should be easy. Yeah. Never heard that saying. That's You're just... welcome, dude. Kyle did it and winked at me. That's yeah. what I guess threw me off. Well, you should, you should try us and try it and tell us how it goes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Like, can I go to the bathroom? Then, yeah. More? yeah. No, you can grab just. Oh, you know, it camera? doesn't have to be bare. How did, how did we get to bare can ass? Can I go to the bathroom real quick? No, <laughs> dude. Just. <laughs> Man, cut. <sighs> We got no answer from that.